Hello students, I am Dr. Tonmoy Bishwas. I welcome you all in my channel, Chemistry and History of Molecule. So let's study during this home locked stage because we all are locked in home because of this pandemic. So let's study and utilize our time. I suggest you that stay in home and follow the instruction given by the government. And it is not always good to always easy to study. But it is not always easy to entertain also because lots of entertainment you are doing but along with that some activity is essential to keep our mental balance in a proper state. So that's why I believe entertainment study if mixed properly such that you don't feel bored of anything not bored from study or bored from entertainment. Okay. So today we will discuss a question. There is a topic better to say. If you heat this pentyl alcohol if you heat this alcohol, you get mixture of pentanes. But if you make this beta hydroxy ketone, you will get selectively alpha beta unsaturated carbonyl compound. So after listening this, you think, sir, what is new in this? We know aldol condensation this. I agree, this is true. But question why and how? Most importantly, the mechanism generally. What happens? Majority of us don't know properly. We know the conclusion. But if you are asked in your viva, like in lab, uh, lab viva or class test, that how this is happening, then if you don't write the proper mechanism, it's difficult. Second, and another question, relative rate, in case of this dehydration is 1, whereas it is 10 to the power 5, see how much uh, fast it is. Another question, why? So this thing will clear in this today's discussion. Okay, and another thing, my video quality will be maybe a little poor because right now I am also locked in my home, so editing is not possible for me right now because I don't have the facility in my home. So please adjust. And another request if you really like my teaching, please help my channel to grow. Okay, so let's start. So, first of all, we learn about the mechanism. First of all, let's try to understand what is the problem. Sulfuric acid dehydration means this is. Acid catalyzed dehydration of alcohol. Okay, this is the main topic we are going to learn. But before going through details, I want to mention I have already uploaded a video regarding the dehydration of al alcohol. Please visit if you want to learn some more. Okay, okay, so this is acid catalyzed dehydration. So first think about the easy one. So this uh, this is the alcohol part. It's a five carbon. One, two, three, four, five. Don't do the mistake because numbering should be this functionalization should be minimum number. Okay, that's the reason. So after that, what is expected? That if you put H plus because sulfuric acid is a strong acid. And another thing, heat is given. So heat favors, heat favors elimination. Okay, you must keep this factor in your mind if you want to solve question as early as possible. So after that, what is expected? That this is OH two plus this this. So it's a protonated species. Yes, it's working. So OH two plus in next step, what happened? This OH two will leave to generate the carbocation. Fine. So this is this. Now what can happen? Carbocat proton could be eliminated, but positions chances there. There are two proton, but here three proton. Fine. Now elimination of proton will occur. That's fine. Now question: From which side will it will occur? It can occur from both sides, but logically, if the elimination will prefer to happen from this because the product pentane is more substituted. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4. No, that should be another one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 is yes. another. So, in this way, what is the product? Finally, so this is, you may consider this is this as a minor product plus along with that, this is as a major product. Okay. So this is, so that's why it is a mixture of pentanes. Because two product produce, fine, we have understood this. Now, the interesting part about this beta hydroxy uh, carbonyl. 
generally we think that okay at the initial stage it will be proliferated and elimination will happen no this will not happen and that is the interesting part which will not see what is expected fast acid base reaction this protonation is also acid base reaction ideally but there is an another reaction also there is lone pair so this could be protonated so what is the thing means what is the expected product this this and it can undergo tautomerism tautomerism means actually keto enol tautomerism so it will be converted into enol so this from this position from this position this proton could be shifted and enol will be produced so this is this 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 okay now now reaction will follow course like that the previous one. means protonation is expected to happen on this carbon okay now you may think that sir why not other one why not here see logically protonation is possible and from this and this both second point that protonation is a reversible process okay but we, which we will consider that part which undergo product second if we think from basic understanding clarity point of view if protonation happens here fine after that elimination will occur see from this what is the pro elimination product? so if it eliminates means let me reduce little space means let me save little space so this so if this elimination happens then what is the expected product cation but if elimination happen from here then this carbon is actually a sp2 since enol so actually this is a vinyl cation so it will result in vinyl cation vinyl c plus which is very unstable but this is allyl cation so this is allyl cation and that is resonance stabilized means let me clean this part a little bit so this is allyl cation so what is the uh, resonance on this this ch3 plus resonance form and see this carbon this carbon atom is a six electron species so this is a six electron species and oxygen has lone pair so oxygen will give its lone pair such that everyone could be octet field fine rule basic rules of resonance so what will be the product this 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 is see this is the protonated protonated version of this so after removal of proton after removal of 1 h plus what it will result it will result carbon interesting part generally what we do so another thing this is acid catalyzed dehydration to prepare this alpha beta unsaturated carbon compound there is another mechanism base catalyzed okay so that concept is difficult means different so please be careful this and ultimately in this way it results in this and why this is very fast the most important part the intermediate is stabilized in the previous case the intermediate was simple carbocation not have any special stabilization factor but this is a allyl carbocation which is resonance stabilized so that is the reason for its extreme reactivity now so we have understood this part for example if we if we uh, if if i give you another example hypothetical this is a hypothetical example the example is exactly same this 1 2 3 4 5 5 alpha hydroxy carbon so this is now ultimately if you do the same process it will result the same product okay now if i ask if i ask that this rate versus this rate which is faster so this is faster keep it in mind because this question is given in your book that's why you may 
the examiner may not ask this question. Comparison could be given alpha hydroxycarbonyl versus this is beta hydroxycarbonyl. Which one is faster for dehydration? Why? See, due for this, intermediate will be produced, which is which is expected to look like this. And see, the positive charge is alpha to carbonyl because carbonyl has minus I and minus R. Why I am saying minus R? Because this is a pure vital. Is a pure vital conjugation possible? Okay. So this makes this system very unstable. So that's why dehydration will be very very slow. But ultimate product will be same. That's a, that's the interesting information. Okay. So this is the end of this discussion. Uh, so what we have learned, we have learned about the dehydration of alcohol without any conjugation. Beta hydroxycarbonyl and alpha hydroxycarbonyl. Which one is faster and why? With a complete mechanism. How? Okay. So thank you for uh, watching this video. If you really like my teaching, I request you please help my channel to grow. First of all, subscribe my channel Chemistry and Mystery of Molecule and please press the bell icon uh, to get the notification of every single video I upload. Secondly, share this video among your friends such that it could be beneficial for other people also who don't know about my channel. And most importantly, please like the video and make some good comment because it inspires a lot. And another uh, important thing, if you think that some modification is essential uh, during this teaching, please feel free to mention in the comment box. I will try to improve myself accordingly such that you people get benefited from my effort. So stay happy, stay blessed, don't be panic, try to live happily inside the home and see you in my next video.